I'm Harriet Muller and today we're going to learn how to draw a simple cartoon monkey. Now the monkey that I'm going to draw is from an illustration that I did for a children's book. So to get started all that you need is a thick black pen, a sharpie or something similar and some acid free paper. So first of all we're going to mark out how big we think we're going to do the monkey. So I'm just going to put a little dot down the bottom and a little dot at the top where I'm going to start and finish the monkey. First of all, we're going to start off with the monkey's head. So we're going to do a U shape, big round U shape like that, at the bottom. And then I'm gonna add some hair. So let's do some crazy monkey hair like this. I know monkeys don't have hair, but I'm giving our monkey a hair. There we go. So, next thing to do are the monkey ears. So we do these big protruding ears on either side. Next stage, we'll do a little monkey nose, a little one like that, and some big, big monkey eyes. So just do two circles, one circle there, and another circle next to it, like so. Now the monkey will really come to life when we give him some eyes. So let's just draw little pupils, little round dots like that. Leave the center with a tiny little bit of white and the other one like that. So he looks like he's coming to life. Now we're going to start the mouth. So if you do a curvy line coming from the nose to the bottom of the face and we do another one on the other side like that and then a little mouth. So just a tiny little mouth like that. Oh, let's make him a little bit more smiley. He doesn't look very smiley, does he? There we go. It's a little bit more smiley now. Okay, so next we have to draw the arms. So we'll start with the right hand arm. So at the bottom of his head, just draw a line horizontally to the side, just like that. Now we're going to make that line into a V shape. So. There's the other part of the line, so you can see there's a V shape there. So we're going to start just to the right of the head and we're going to do another line that's parallel to this line. So that's parallel to that. Now make it curve round, like so. We'll do another line that's parallel to this line. Another line like that. So that's his arm. We're going to start the left arm now. So the same theory, you start just underneath the head. Now we're going to do a V shape going down like this and another one coming up. We're going to do the same and we're going to do one line that's parallel to this line and another one that's parallel to this line. Now we have the arms. The next stage, we're going to do the hands. Now, I try and keep them really simple. So instead of doing lots of fingers at the start, I'll just do almost like a mitten hand. So by that, I mean just do a little curvy line for the thumb, make it come round, and then you've got the top of the hand there. You do another curvy line round like that, and then you just go across. So it looks like a mitten or kind of like a Lego hand but we'll add some fingers, so just draw a line down and another line down. And now for the other hand, the other hand's going to be holding a banana. So we'll use the same theory, we'll do a curved line round for the thumb, then a backward C shape, and then we'll do the top of the hand, come round, join it all up and give it some fingers. And then for the banana, just draw a curvy line like that, another curvy line that's parallel, and then another bit there. Do like a dotted line down, and then add some black on the top and black on the bottom. The next stage is to draw the body. So we're going to do a long vertical line going up, just starting kind of just off from half of the head. Go to the left and start halfway. So go up and we do a little curve round like that. 
Now we're going to do the same, but the opposite way around. Starting from the armpit of the monkey, we're going to go up vertically and go round. Now, the next stage to do the legs. Just from the top of the body, come down a little way and just start the leg there. We'll come out and do another vertical line parallel. Come down and the foot's going to be behind the arm, so we won't see much of it, which is quite good. It means less drawing. So go round with the toe and up like that. And you'll just be able to make out the heel. So there we go. And go round. So that's one leg with the foot. The other leg's going to start behind the monkey, so we won't see most of it. So we're just going to see the foot, which will come round, go down, make sure that it's in line with the other foot. Come round, do the toes, one toe there, one toe there. And then we'll do the heel, round like that, and so. So that's the monkey, and he's hanging down. He's going to be hanging by his tail, so that's the next bit but he's got his legs hanging down and his arms out like that. Now our monkey's going to be hanging and swinging from the branch of a tree. So we need to give him a tail. So at the top, this is the monkey's bottom, go round, go round a little bit more. And then we'll start the tail, which just goes another line vertically up like that and do a little curvy bit on the end. Now we're going to follow that round on the other side, another line going vertically up and curve it round like so. Then we're going to do the branch of the tree which is coming out like that. So just do a diagonal line and the other bit of the branch. So I'm just going to draw a little bit of the tree. So the tree is coming down here, so it's a nice big old tree like that. We're just going to draw half of the tree. You're not going to see the whole thing, just to let people know that there is actually a tree there. And then you'll carry the tree up like that. Now, we're going to do the other bit, the tail, because the tail is going to go round twice. So, we're just going to do like a backward S shape like that, and wrap it round like that. And then we're going to carry on the tree branch. We're going to carry on this line here, and carry it on up like that. Then we're going to carry on this line here and carry it on upwards like so. Now the last bit, the way that we're going to finish our monkey is so that tail is going up, it's wrapping round and then we just do a little bit of the tail hanging out like so. And that's your finished monkey. Now that's the drawing part finished of our cartoon monkey. If you want to really finish it off and make it look like an illustration, um, I'll put up a picture of the actual illustration that I did so that you can copy the colours and see how I did that. Um, so you can make this into anything that you want. You can add a different background, you can do a jungle scene, you can put your monkey anywhere. Um, so I really hope you enjoyed that and I'll be doing some more beginner's guides soon. So thank you very much and I'll see you on the next one. Bye bye.